Hey everybody, how's it going? So, I figured that tonight we would do a Model K building stream, and, well, I had the gun right here that I wanted to make because I picked it up a couple days ago, and you know what, I, I, I've been really wanting to get back into making Model Kits, and unfortunately, I haven't come across any new Pokemon to make, or any of the new, like, Halo stuff, or... No, I think that's actually the only other Model Kits that we make it is just Pokemon and Halo. Why that gif? Why not that gif? See, Moon, in these streams, we love and appreciate Majima. <laughs> How you doing, hon? Uh, so, yeah. Uh, something funny about this Gundam uh, model kit I got. I basically got it next to nothing. Because when I was going to the, the hobbyist store just to kill some time on, on a weekend day, uh, I saw a couple of this. The other one was the... As I talked about on the earlier stream was the X-Wing. The good version of the X-Wing because I hate the stupid design of the Resistance X-Wing. So we get the original like uh, classic trilogy X-Wing that we might build if we have time afterwards. But who knows. If anything, I might save doing those uh, fighter builds for if I can get either like maybe a Y-Wing, U-Wing, B-Wing, or A-Wing. Where'd that come from? Get out of here. <clears throat> And I figured, you know, uh, I I just do like a little fighter squadron building of it. But God, I've looked at the price at like say the B wing, and it is expensive. So I might see if I can just maybe get one more fighter, and we might do that. Or you know, if we end on a decent time, I might just go ahead and build the X wing tonight. But for now, uh, let's get some music on, and let's build ourselves a robot. Well, not a robot mech suit. You know what I mean. Gonna bring the funk into the stream. All right, let's do this. <clears throat> oh man, what's this? Mobile Studio DX available on PlayStation 4. Hell yeah! Oop. Looks like a... I remember there being like a Mobile Suit Gundam like Warriors game, like Dynasty Warriors and Hyrule Warriors and such. I wonder if they are... if that's what it's advertising, because it, from the back of the little pamphlet right here, it kind of resembles it. Or it may just be like a straight-up Gundam game that you can just make your own custom Gundam in. Which is cool. <clears throat> Alright. Let's get these open, and let's see what we got to work with. <laughs> well, you know, the man's got groove. Also, I could totally see him dancing to a song like this, and that's why I made him dance to a song like this. God, it actually fits way too well. <laughs> Almost missed the stickers. And not too many stickers. That's good. Alright, as always, we shall put this up in the corner so people can see what we are building if any new people hop in. <clears throat> Let's put. Ooh, I don't really have a whole lot of room. Man, these sheets are huge! Like, look at the size of this compared to my hand. That is a lot of parts. That's C, this is B, that's A, and this one is PC2. <clears throat> and this, which I'm guessing is for the beam saber, because it looks like it might be. Alright. Oh boy, where do I start? Uh, let's see, that looks to be the body. That's the stand. I guess we can build the weapons first and also the shield. That way we can get those out of the way. <clears throat> Alright, oh, it's twin beam sabers, that's why. 
All right, C26 and 27 and 25. Can't stop watching the GIF. I know, I can't keep my eyes off Majima either. Wait, no, I didn't mean it that way. 25, 26, and 27, yep. <clears throat> also, go check out Popsy uh, .bandcamp.com. This is actually his newest, newest album, and has some really good themes in it. Like, I've been listening to it for the past couple of days while I was working on grinding up money in Yakuza, and it just, damn, does he bring the funk in this one? There we go. I just don't want to... If I pull it too close to me, I just don't want to run the risk of me accidentally snapping uh, a part of this. Alright. So this... This goes at a small spot right here. Really? Okay, yeah. Fits like a glove. We connect the other side of the cannon right here. Possibly, if I can line it up correctly. Mm. Come on. Yeah, there we go. Alright. There we go. Okay, let's see. Uh, let's see. C28, 29, and 30. I like that these are all together and not spaced out between the three different pegboards. Or the three big pegboards. See that? That would be the. Looks like the nose cone for the cannon. And this seems to be the sights. Alright. This? Oh, yeah. Just like that. That's it for the the giant cannon.
There we go. Hmm. Actually, fit him pretty easily. Okay, let's see. Take this. Take this. Stick this in here. Then I take this and put it right here. Yes. Close the cap. I will ask, uh, since you're here, Moon, how, how does my voice sound compared to the music? Do I need to turn the music down a little bit, or do I need to turn my voice up a bit? Right, which way? This way. There we go. Voice up a little bit? All right. Okay, how's this? Better? <clears throat> Alright. Shield time. Yes, alright, that's good. Eek. Eek. There we go. Where is the... Oh, there it is. Then there's a lot of thick pieces in here because I don't w want to run the risk of uh, breaking this. Hey, I'm Lex. Gundam models, physical Gundam, Gundam models are the champions. <laughs> oh, you were doing the Digimon theme. How's it going? Uh, hope you're having a good night tonight. Ow! I'm just here hurting myself building models. Mm. Let's see. And this. Take like out. I think I might have it backwards. No, that can't be right. Uh oh, I think you're stuck. Oh, I see. There's like a little notch right there, so it wasn't stuck. There we go. And put the plating over there. Perfect. All right, C21 and C20. Don't think require nippers. Uh, they, they might, I just don't have any. Funk is back. Okay, small handle goes here. This goes right here. There we go. And brings out the little shield part. Just notice Majima. <laughs> Fine, we'll just set it flat. Kind of have a bit, bit of an angle, but I guess that's fine. Where is, okay, there's the there's the gun. All right, so we got uh, all the weapons done. We got the shield done. I think I'm just mm, I might make a bean saber, but I'm gonna save it until we get done with the the suit itself. Because what I think I might do is uh, go with the shoulder can, or the giant shoulder cannon in the back. Uh, I think the rifle goes to the side, or uh, actually, I might just keep it as like rifle, shield, uh, giant cannon in the back, and the beam sabers and the little pouches on its shoulders. All right, time for the hard part. All right. A6 and A12. Let's see, 
9, 10, 11, 12. Ooh. Also, I honestly wasn't thinking uh, when it came to putting the Majima gift there because I didn't think it would be that in sync with the, with the funk tonight. PC12 and or PC2. Yep. These, these ones seem to be easy to get out. I get the dip into the Gundam models, but I'm a big fan of the Bandai Star Wars models. Oh, you mean something like this? in here all right circles facing out and they go into the okay I see these are like for the arms all right just slightly into the little notches done the snow sweeter stormtrooper and boba fett uh, the only one that we've done so far is the First Order Stormtrooper, and that was a, that was about it when it came to the Star Wars model kits. And seeing as how it looks like I might be done with uh, Pokemon model kit building, since there isn't any new ones out I've seen, uh, we might do Star Wars ones next. I'm looking to see if I can get all the Rebel ships. Alright, let's see. C4 and C35. But I actually wouldn't mind uh, building a snow speeder at some point because that's actually another one of my favorite ships. Uh, where are you, 35? There you are. There we go. Alright, and it says PC4, which is right here. Get out! Get out! Come on! Ah! There we go. Okay, so this goes at the end of here. Uh, good luck. Uh, I'm trying to find all of the Rebel Fighters, so I'm trying to still find a Y-Wing, U-Wing, A-Wing, and B-Wing. But from what I've seen in terms of the price for, like, say, the B-Wing, it's pretty expensive. Alright, A-8 and A-5. Five. And there's eight. Maybe. Maybe. Ah. Moon, what was that? Mm hmm. Four. Oh man, the A Wing is like my favorite, favorite rebel ship. It, it's my favorite. Uh, when I played Star Wars Squadrons, it was my go to ship just because it, it was what I was best at in that. this and then now what? Oh I see there's like little slots on the side of the chest plate. Ah right, line it up. There we go. You're talking about looking at it and yes it's very money. <laughs> 
It's like a space sports car. Get in there. There we go. Alright. Alright, circles go up top. There we go. Now you two get to stay in there and not have to worry about you falling out anymore. And I shall get a 9, which is right here. Should get the clone trooper model before they hike up the price again. Uh, now that you say that, uh, I didn't know they were making they made uh, Clone Wars model kits because I would love to build Clone Wars ships too. Probably my favorite era out of all the things, and it's mostly because of the Clone Wars series. Oh, no. All right, line it up. Don't force it. Do I have it right? Yeah, I do. Why is there a tiny lip right there? Trooper and a swappable Mark 1, Mark 2 heads. I don't know if that didn't lock it. I'm surprised they didn't do like uh, the gunship or anything like that for the Clone Wars. Ah, okay, we might have a problem here. Why is this not going in? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Nope, nope, yes, no, no, no. Alright, let's see if I can get this back piece off. There we go. First things first, let's put this in here. Alright. Now that that's in there, let's put the arm pieces back in the little spots. The AT gunship might be a favorite ship of all time. It's a lot of people's favorite ship. Like, I know a lot of people who like it over the X-Wing, which is crazy. But it's a it's a really nicely designed ship. Hey, Terabyte. How's it going? Uh, I think I have this upside down. Yes, I do. No, I didn't. Yes, I did. Did I? Yes, I did. Uh, it stands for an old dead name I used to have. Uh-oh. I, I don't like reliving the dark days. Ah, there we go. There we go. Alright. Let's see. Ah, no. No! One of the arm pieces went sideways. Ah. Don't know if you can see it. Uh, yeah, uh, it completely flipped up upside. God. Oh no. Oh no. I I now caught it. Oh no. <laughs> ah, I'm I might be a bit stuck unless I can find a way to get this back piece off again because these stupid arms are not working. Ah, 
Ha, <laughs> crap. We might have a problem here. Take your time, Memwax. So what did it used to stand for? <sighs> it used to stand for the Big Game Hunter. It, it, it was an old dead name. It was super cringy. I hate it. I dreaded it. And the reason it's changed to this now, funny enough, is because of Twitter. I, I When I first started Twitter, I wanted to make a, a smaller handle because I felt like that one was way too big to use. So I decided to shorten it down to this, and it just kind of stuck with me ever since. Is it? Is it pizza? Uh oh. Oh, thanks. I, honestly, I really hate my old name. It's just... Every time I think about it, I cringe a bit. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. There's specific ways they go in. Oh, that's why they weren't uh, working right. Whoop. Oh, no. Not again. We might have a problem. Okay, so one's flat and one's uh, more pointed. Put that there. Can I see the uh, side of the box? Yeah, sure. Uh, which side did you want to see? The narrow side? Like, uh, you want to see... This side, although it's a little out of focus, just because that's just how high up my thing is. Uh, there's this side with the many different poses with the weapons. Then there's this, which is covered up by the label. And then there's this side, which... I got the same RX, it was your first gun... Gundam? Oh, cool! I think it might have been a lot of people's first Gundam because it's like one of the most iconic models in terms of Gundams. Right. Wait, you? Come on. Uh oh. Right. Now you two, stay in place. Yes! It worked! Aha! Nice. Where was I? Oh, right here. Alright, PC1, A14. It was the first Gundam. Alright. A14, which would be this. I, I, I'm, tr I'm thinking back to the time when I first got introduced into Gundam, and uh, the first time I was ever introduced into the series was, funny enough, uh, when I got first introduced to Tanami. I forget which uh, series of Gundam it was, though. It was like the one where all the nations of the world had their like their own little floating islands in space, and there was like a big like competition, Gundam Wing. Yeah, that might be it. I remember that to it when I first uh, saw Gundam and I got really interested. You know I mean, the late 90s? I think so. It was either late 90s or like very early 2000s. It was when Toonami was still playing during daytime hours and not like late at night hours like it is now. Okay, C24, 36. 1, 32, 34. Six.
Now, while I, I got introduced to Gundam through Toonami, it actually wasn't uh, what I got introduced uh, into Toonami. Uh, for the longest time, I didn't even know that Toonami or Cartoon Network, uh, by extension, even existed. Uh, but I was channel, channel surfing one day, and I came across Toonami when it was playing the original Dragon Ball. And I thought, oh, this looks different. I might as well stick around and see what it is. And then I, I just kept watching and watching and got insanely hooked on it. Yeah, simpler times. I, I miss those days. Like, yeah, there's still good stuff that plays on Toonami now, and there's uh, some good things on TV and such, but I don't know. There, there's usually, like, a, a magic uh, when, you were, when you were a kid and you first got introduced to that stuff. It's just, like, it was the big wow factor. The A and B9. Oh, we're actually working into B again. Has a horribly dough. IBO is outstanding. What, which one's what's IBO or what's it stand for? Because I think the only Gundam I saw was Gundam Wing. Oh, what was it? B9 and 8. There you are. Oh, Iron Oh, Iron Blood Orphans! That's what it was. Yeah, I think I remember seeing a bit of that as well. I never watched the whole thing because I think it was like uh, during the tsunami hours where I couldn't uh, stay up that late. But oh man, now we're just thinking. Oh, now you're saying Big O Moon. Oh, don't don't remind me of Big O. It was so good. We're just going through a nostalgia trip tonight. It seems. Thing right. was like this. Yeah. I would say yes, Moon, but to be fair, uh, it did get cancelled at one point, but Toonami itself funded the, like, official ending to it because it got uh, cancelled shortly be before they could finish making the ending to the show. But Toonami fronted the money to say, hey, we would like to actually give this uh, series an ending, which is really cool, in my opinion. Oh, you didn't know that, Moon? Alright, time for the head. A1 and A3. Oh, that's what this is for. Oh my god, this thing is so tiny! Oh, uh, if I even think about it being in a different area it is, it's just gonna disappear. Here, how it is, uh, compared to my hand, the glare might not make it easy for you to see. What was it? A3. Ooh, I got scared for a second because I thought I snapped uh, this thing in half. Ugh. Uh, thankfully, it just not. It was just a peak piece of the thing that was holding it to the pegboard. Oh god, I, it is so hard to see where I need to put this thing. I can't tell which... Okay, there it is. Alright, like this. Ooh. Way this go. This. 
Oh, nope. Is that the wrong way? I can't tell. Oh, wait. Nope, this is the way. Oh. It is so tiny. Okay, we got it on. It's a little loose, and I'm scared I will lose that thing. Alright, B25 and B20. B19, B20 right here. And B19 as well. So I just to have it. Yeah. Break the board, damn you. There we go. Okay, let's see. What was the other one? B19, B, uh, B25. Oh god, it's so small. Why is, why is this helmet so small? on there. chance to check it out yet. I'll check it out at the stream hunt. Gonna make this easy for me, are ya? Wait a second. was a frame to put oh no I've got to put I've got to put this sticker onto this piece this tiny tiny piece that you can barely see because of the light I'll put it you can't even see it on there it's so small you can barely see it on the stream for me to see where this thing is. Oh, it's so hard to see what's right, and it will not stay still for a 
sick when I need it to. Ooh. Adhesive is not the best for these goggle parts. Okay. Get in there. Get in there. There we go. I have no idea. What even is the point of the stickers for the back of the... Thing. There we go. Got it. Eyes were. I had the whole thing upside down. That was the problem. Because I'm a dumbass. But we got the helmet made. The, the, the very, very tiny helmet. Okay. What next? in sync in my heart. Damn, he's still in sync. Oh god, it's so small. How did I expect you to put these on properly? They're so small, you can barely register it on my thick finger. You can see, see a tiny red dot. That, that is a sticker I need to put onto the front of this helmet. And somehow I did it flawlessly.
get in there. Got it. Nice. Not easy to see. Oh, it's almost impossible to see because of the glare and uh, blur. Oh, I've been trying to fix the blur. I think it's just because of what the type of camera I'm using. It's better at a distance than it is up close. Definitely would love to spring for a more higher quality camera. Two of them, actually, so I can get one for a side view and the other for a top view. Ooh, boy, this one. I feel like I just snap it just by mere thought alone. Oh, thank God. All right, there we go. Got the little pet helmet antenna. There, put you right there. Oh, that was a heart attack and a half. B3, uh, PC3, and B14, or B13. There we go. Alright, C3, C6, and C2. Right, that's... There we go. So, 3, 6, and 2, was it? Yeah. Okay, let's see. 
that on this? Oh god, it's hard to tell which is which. Okay, there, that actually helps. I had to look at the bottom. Wait, what? Hold the phone. Oh, it's down here. There we go. that done B12 which would be right here ooh, ooh. Ooh, that could have been bad We were gonna go with shield and uh, gun. Uh, I'm gonna need to pull back to the front page real quick just to see what what hands we need for that. I got it backward. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, I can get this on. <laughs> Hand on upside down like an idiot. Alright, let's try this again, shall we? Getting somewhere. Whew. All right. Now for the other arm. Then the legs, and then the base, and then we will be done. Thank you. 
Same drill as before. Every time, every time I look at this piece that's uh, a joint for the arm, it, it, it just looks like a little revolver to me. finger there we go let's get these on first that way I don't have to wrestle with the little leg or the arm arm pieces as much as I, I like Ben's music I, I kind of want to uh, look for some more Kowski. Moon, everything in here is really pointy and also really like close together. This, this, are you giving me that side eye, Moon?
Uh, yeah. Yes. No. Yes. This way. This. This. need a little bit of force to go in there. Alright. What did I need for the back of the shield? I need... I think... Oh, is that the... Let's see, back parts of a hand. I... don't see a back... Oh, maybe this is it? like it might be. on. Damn. What does it say? C I have a C5. I put C4 on. Try this again. My dumb butt picked the wrong piece. my life any easier. Come on. Yeah, come on. Okay, 
save it. Yes, I did. Nice. lot smaller than I thought it was going to be. Granted, it was only 15, so I wasn't expecting it to be big, but still. Okay, now that that is done, it's time to work on the legs. P29 and PC7 and A4. Okay, so the legs are both the, or the feet are both the same. All right. Five, six, seven, there you are. I think I picked the wrong one. I definitely picked the- oh wait, no I didn't. Oh, that's the uh, arm joint, or leg joint. Yeah, 
There we go. Don't worry, uh, I might take a, a small stretch when we uh, get this leg done. Might get something to drink as well. B28 and 27, PC8, two of them actually. out like like that okay what were the light parts b28 and 27 come on come on ow ah, that just went right down the thumb Model kit is such a painful uh, hobby. Jeez. Hmm. All right. No. Oh, jeez. Where do these things go? Oh, in the circles. Not 
want that right there. B22. If I can find you, what are you hiding? Hey, where? Ooh, and it's off. All right, there we go. Got one leg done. Now, let's take a small intermission so I can stretch my legs because it has been quite a bit. Uh, all right, I'm gonna take five. When we get back, we will hopefully finish this up tonight. I don't think we're gonna be able to do the X-Wing, so I might save that for whenever I decide to get the other uh, Rebel model kits. We'll see. For now, uh, I'm gonna go stretch my legs and get some water. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Sorry about that uh, long wait. Uh, we 
should be good now, and I got me some water. So let's finish up the model kit, shall we? And I also got the uh, room open for CoCom, so they can hop in when they'd like. All right. So one leg down, all we're missing is the waist and the other leg, and then the little extra bells and whistles, which I think it's just... I think that's also with the waist. There's still the... The little thing that we use to attach uh, the cannon to the back of the Gundam. Alright, let me get the music back on. And let's just shovel to a new song. That way we don't have to start uh, mid-song. Hi, Moon. Hello. Alright, good. Let me shuffle off. Uh, where can I shuffle? Here, uh... Uh, what can you play? Uh, here, we can we can put, we'll play this song. <laughs> Just a little bit. There we go. All right, back to those this work. Okay, so we're done with all that. So all that is left is the final part. Uh, so close to getting done with the uh, board, and I'm happy. <laughs> uh, hold on, we, we brought the funk back. Get I, I keep looking over at the corner of my eye and watch him <laughs> He's too in sync with these songs. I'm sorry. No, I'm not. No, you're not. I, I, uh, yeah, I'm not. Flat out not. Listen, when you gotta do the hustle, you do the hustle. That's not how it goes, but okay. That, that, that's the Majima way of doing the hustle. <laughs> what, it sounded like you were playing the Mortal Kombat thing for a second? <laughs> no. It sounded like no, it. No, not at all. <laughs> like, like, the, like the startup version of it. Dee, 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 dee. <laughs> brat. Yes. 30 and 31. Wait. Okay, yeah. You can just put these up. <laughs> and... There we go. Oh, God. God, it's still in sync! <laughs> You did it. <laughs> no, he's doing it. Too well, in fact. All these songs he's just been in sync with. <laughs> <laughs> so, I'm actually really excited uh, that we're doing Yakuza tomorrow because I learned a very interesting fact, but I want both you and Dragon here to hear it. Oh, dear. Or at least as much people as I can get onto the stream when I say it, mm -hmm. just because not in a million years are you going to know this, and it's going to blow your mind. Should we be in a uh, voice call when you tell us this? <laughs> so yeah, you can hear uh, our reaction. I, I want to hear you. Yes. <laughs> I got this backwards. There we go. Let's see. 22, 23. There you are. Sorry, I had to get that out. Hey, no worries. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Anytime someone says Kuze, all I can think is how many times do I have to teach you this lesson, old man? <laughs> uh, but I might as well talk a bit about Yakuza tomorrow. Uh, what I plan to do, hopefully, is either get all of... Kiryu's uh, side stories that are still out in the field done, 
That includes the disco ugh, and also pocket circuit. Mm-hmm. But the other thing I really want to get done is the, the real estate stuff. Yeah. I, I basically want to clear out everything I can do in Camarocho before we go to Sotenbori with Kiryu. So that's why I... That's why we've been spending so much time in Camarocho. Yeah. I'm sure people are getting sick and tired of seeing Camarocho. I think everybody misses Majima. <laughs> Any sane person misses Majima. <laughs> I mean, I like Kiryu and all, but Majima's Majima. It's Majima. <laughs> you, can't, you can't ever say no to Majima. No. Especially with moves like that. <laughs> <laughs> Got this slow like waltz uh, music uh, music that uh, is playing right now. It still fits with that little dance he's doing. <laughs> it's so elegant. <laughs> that doesn't help with the fact that he's wearing a suit. <laughs> I, I'm just picturing like an anime moment where the girl's like, Kia! <laughs> Please, no more anime sounds. Please. <laughs> I could barely handle it last night or uh, last week. It was just too damn funny. Kill you be cool, but Majima just boogieing now. <laughs> what are those? I love those. Pajama, pajama party. Those are pretty good. Uh, so, I, uh, go ahead. You, you, you need a you need a Majima emote with the purple flames. <laughs> wouldn't it, wouldn't it just be uh, his breaker style uh, fighting then? Yeah, I guess. <laughs> you, you say Majima and then like a purple flames, and that's just like that's just getting heat uh, for breaker. <laughs> But, as I was saying, I was thinking of a cursed uh, emote for the channel. Or at least for the Discord at the moment. Mm-hmm. View shoes. <laughs> they wouldn't squeak. It, it would just be the shoes. Cat shoes. <laughs> <laughs> I could hear and it. Apparently, of course... <laughs> <laughs> you just hear... I mean, it's bad enough I made an alert with those damn shoes, but still. Anyway, go on. Uh, I, I was gonna say, uh, Majima has his own variant, which it, thankfully isn't meowing, as Tamo has said, but... Uh, apparently it's the exact same thing as the Mew shoes for him. Mm. Okay. I'm, d I'm just treading because I know Dragon's going to be like, Mew Mew, motherfucker. Because he will. <laughs> oh, I know he will. And knowing him, if any of his other friends are on, he's probably going to try and get them in on the Mew party. Oh, fuck. Dee, 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 dee. What are you doing? Nothing. What are you doing? I'm not doing anything, I swear! Mm, that sounds like someone plotting. Plotting? <laughs> I'm, being, I'm being myself! <laughs> yeah, too bad sometimes yourself ends up plotting. I'm not plotting, <laughs> you brat! <laughs> <laughs> Me a Brad? How dare you? How dare you, ma'am? You know what? You know what you are. Yes. You know what? you are. What? I'm. I'm what? You're a brat. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. I'm TBG. There's a difference. You're a bratty TBG. I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> That just gave me Baruka sweet vibes just now when you did. <laughs> Don't care how I want it now. Oh! <laughs> did you just facepalm? Yes. 
You didn't hear the smack of my hand hit my face. <laughs> I I just wanted to confirm it. Yep. God, I can't believe that my streams have gotten so bad it's actually caused people physical pain. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> um, let's see. Dying of laughter, our sides hurting, that's not physical pain. <laughs> <laughs> that, that was your choice. <laughs> I will not take the fall for that, oh, Brad. Okay. You heard it here, folks. EBG will not what, be liable. It... <laughs> I am not liable for any uh, hilarity or insanity that insanity that happens on these streams. Uh, <laughs> especially if I end up glitching the game somehow. <laughs> Bayonetta. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> right, that goes on to here, hopefully. Come on. Come on. Get it in there. Get it. Mm. <laughs> there we go. It, it was. Ah, uh, let's see. B twenty two. didn't go all the way in, that's why. <laughs> that box is so huge compared to the model itself. <laughs> <laughs> well, they usually are. It's just funny, it's like, look how freaking big the box is and you got this teeny tiny model. <laughs> well, to be fair, it had to fit like three of these in there. These things are as big as the box themselves. Yeah, I know. It just cracks me up how small it is in the end. <laughs> Alright, let's see. C18, PC6, and B23. This. This. C18. There you are. Anytime I hear this song, I just think that it's like a one of those shoot 'em up games. Mm -hmm. It's just like a, a space stage. Yeah. And Majima's still in sync. <laughs> He's like, I'm gonna get the groove with this techno vibe. I feel I feel like if ever we do get a Majima emote, it, it's gonna be like it's gonna be like vibes, uh, like vibe. <laughs> Love it. So that's all our boy is doing is just straight up vibing.
I still can't believe I'm going to a concert next month. It's going to be so much fun. Oh yeah, what, what concert? Uh, Queen's Reich. Ah. Well, so, hope you stay safe at least. It's gonna be uh, it's gonna be weird because we have to wear our masks, but I think it'll be a lot of fun. To be fair. Some people usually wear masks at concerts before this whole mess happens, so it, it won't look out of place. Yeah, I'm just not going to hear the end of it from one of my grandmothers, though. Yeah, well. Be like, I'm not going to listen to you, I'm going to listen to the music. Small piece. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Okay, there it is. Thank God. Almost dropped it. <laughs> Thankfully, it hasn't been as much as we've done in past model kits, but still. <laughs> Like, I still feel like Majima would group out to it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, where the hell does this piece go? This go. Do you want me to do this game? Okay, like this. <laughs> also, I say game because I've been too, too used... It's been so long since we've done model kits that I... <gasps> I'm too used to saying, okay, what do you want me to do, game? What? <laughs> this? Alright, then. <laughs> Alright, PC4, C31. I think that's the last PC. Yeah, that one's... It's been a while. What? What? Nothing. What? Discord. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. What's going on? Oh, no. <laughs> Cursed, cursed. C31, which I think, yep, right here. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna ignore what I saw on Discord. I'm crying. <laughs> Ooh, that was close. TBG, stop dropping things. No. Stop it. I must. No. Okay, now it makes sense. <sighs> Alright. A11, A10, and B5. I think... Nope, we're still missing one piece. Mm. Then we'll be done with A for good. Yeah. 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 There we go. I'm laughing at you. What? I'm laughing at you. Wow, so so rude. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> okay, get the butt flap. Or I think this might be the crotch flap, I don't know. So, a gud loincloth. Got it. Uh, not really. It, 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 it's more of like a hip armor. <laughs> Can't stop, don't stop. I just no. Nothing will keep Majima from the groove. Well, and it's it's like this rocking music too, and it's like, yeah, he's still going. <sighs> Jeez, there are so many things here. Alright. Thankfully, this is the final sticker. I need a seven. Somewhere where I can't find it. It would help if I'm actually on the right one. That's C, not A. Ow. What is she going on about up there? <laughs> <laughs> Do you like you progressively gets luck? <laughs> she she heard the the guitar solo and just like, alright, I gotta meet I gotta match it. <laughs> I, th I think she might be singing in my birds now that I think about it. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, nope, we're missing one piece for B. Which... Huh. Huh. Okay, then. There's still a piece on B, but I don't see... I went through the entire thing, and I did not see where it was supposed to go. <laughs> This while we're at the very end. Do, 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 do. Please. And there goes the shield. And the back of his hand. <laughs> Alright. 
There we go. Okay, what am I missing? Like this way. Connect that to there. Come on. Side. Get it to the side. To the, su the side. Alright, actually. <laughs> that shield again. No shield. For some reason, he just doesn't want to hold that shield. So what we'll do is we'll stick the shield into his back. And we should give him the giant cannon. ourselves a Gundam. Woohoo! For some reason, though, it didn't include a base form, which is weird. There, there, there is no base uh, to put under this guy. I'm looking. I don't see anything in any of the the bags that these came in. So either it they forgot to actually put it into the kit. Or it's separate. Oh well. Put in a, a th uh, the thing that had the base in it. Yeah. Well, 
Was there a base? Uh, usually when it comes to model kit building, there's usually a base. Hmm. All right. Let me just clean all this up real quick. I'll probably uh, save this one. This has the little bean saber beans in it. But yeah, there we go, people. We got ourselves our very own custom-made Gundam. It's so tiny. <laughs> it's so tiny. Now we just need to figure out where the hell to put it. <laughs> All right. Alright, now let's get intermission because that is where we are going to call it for tonight because it is late. I still have to work tomorrow, unfortunately, and I want to get a few more uh, uh, things uh, done before I actually do have to go to sleep proper. <clears throat> yep. But this was fun. Mm -hmm. I thoroughly enjoyed making it, and I know that there are other Gundam models at that uh, hobby store that I usually visit, so I might actually pick up another Gundam. Who knows? I might also pick up something that'll make it easier for me to see where the hell uh, these little tiny pieces disappear to. Yeah. Because <laughs> it gets ridiculous at times. I believe it. Uh, Twitch, why are you not working? There you go. <sighs> Alright, so schedule. This week is going to be a bit different from past weeks, uh, because we are going to get a double fill of Yakuza. We are going to be making a... Uh, we're going to be, once again, hopefully finishing up the little side story thing in Kiryu's section tomorrow, as well as hopefully beat the other side stories as well. Mm -hmm. uh, other than that, Wednesday we'll continue Bayonetta, and Thursday we will... Once again, keep doing more Yakuza. And then uh, Saturday should either be uh, maybe a community night with Among Us or maybe a uh, continuation of 3D World. Hmm. All right. Uh, let's look for a raid target. I think I know someone we can... Oh, I... oh are they? Oh, yeah. Looks like they are. Okay. Uh, we're gonna raid someone who's also building their own Gundam. Well, look at that. I don't think we really have a raid message for tonight. Uh, so we're just gonna send the raid proper. We are going to... Uh, let's see. We are going to raid... Someone by the name of... Holy hell, those Gundams are expensive. That That's not the person streaming. Uh, he just put up a thing, a listing of other Gundams, and it was just like, geez, those things are expensive. <laughs> uh, we're gonna raid Animisk, who is... I, what model is he building right now? I'll have to look. I'm not, I'm not sure. All right. All right, everybody. I will see you all tomorrow, probably around 9 or 9.30 to uh, continue Yakuza. Thanks all for coming by. Thanks to everybody who showed support tonight. Uh, definitely we'll try to do another Model Kid stream uh, maybe Sunday or Monday next week if I can find the other uh, ships for a decent price. Because I know this is a pretty expensive hobby at times. <clears throat> Anyways, that is all. Good night, everybody. Hope you all had fun. I will see you all tomorrow. Also, link to the past VODs going up on Thursday. Good night, everybody. <laughs> Good night.